Meanwhile, the state legislature is considering taking action that could make women feel a little more secure in what they wear. NBC 15's Kate Pambish is here to explain. Lee, it's called upskirting, taking a picture of someone's skirt or down their shirt without them knowing. According to the current law, it's a mere misdemeanor, but legislators are looking to change that. Sitting on the bleachers at a football game, shopping at your local grocery store. Some of the last places you think to watch for predators. And that's why Representative Melissa Sargent says it's the worst kind of crime. And I am quite sure that many of his victims will never even know that these photos were taken of them. Think about that. It's pretty creepy. With technology on the rise, timers, remotes, and better pictures are helping peeping toms from getting caught. This perpetrator was caught only due to the viewing of store security footage after the fact. If a person is out in public, say standing in the grocery store line, that they wouldn't have an expectation of privacy. Well, we normally wouldn't have an expectation of privacy, but I think under our clothing, regardless of where we are, we have an expectation of privacy. The law, if passed, would make it a class I felony, punishable by up to three years in jail for taking a picture of someone's butt breast, genitals, or body without their consent. This bill solves a problem that has plagued prosecutors for about 22 years. The vagueness of our laws, specifically our statutory definition of nudity and the opaqueness or presence of an undergarment, has left legislative loopholes allowing upskirting offenders to go unpunishable for these atrocious violations of personal space and privacy. What reasonable distinction does it make to a victim to say, this captured your thigh, this captured your midriff, but this did not capture that portion of the body that the legislature has defined as nude. The bill still has a long way to go before becoming law, but it has bipartisan support. Now, the question did come up, what if someone takes a picture of a beach scene and captures someone in it in their swimsuit? Well, that would not be considered a crime since that is what the person was wearing in public and the picture wasn't taken up or 